Welcome to episode 18 of Road to the Show, where we have the Mariners visiting for the Cubs in a two-game series, which will be the last one. Let's see if the Mariners can sweep the Cubs in a two-game series. Here's what the standing looks so far. The Astros are in first place. The Angels are half a game behind. We're a full game behind in the West. A's barely above 500, and the Rangers are falling at 57 and 70. Other than the Rangers, we have a solid. Four teams are basically running for the playoffs. Four out of five teams in the West are going for playoff positions. That's crazy. Wouldn't that be amazing if that happened in real life? Bears being a part of it. We are set to bring you baseball from one of the crown jewels of the sport, memorable Wrigley Field in Chicago. Today, the See if I can break Griffey's record. Game series between the Seattle Mariners and the Chicago Cubs. Let's have a look at the starting lineup for the visiting Seattle Mariners. They'll line themselves up like this here this afternoon. Well, let's sure. also get a brief look at our two starting pitchers so you can see how they stack up right there. Lester is part of the Red Sox championship team, so Paxton, well, he isn't doing so well this year. What a nice looking stadium. Jason Lofgren makes his way to the plate. He'll get us started here in the top of the second. Alright, see if I can break the record by Junior, a club record for most home runs in a single season. Ooh. Swing and a ball pretty well hit out towards left. Uh, no, but and he's gonna kick off the second with extra bases. So a base hit here to start the inning. Nice. And he continues to pile them up as we take a look at our league leaders in hits so far. And as you see, he's right up there among league leaders in that department. 50 away from breaking Ichiro's record. 50 hits away. William Sasaki will get his first shot here. A couple of hits in four trips last night. A runner at first with no outs here. And here's a ball hit in the air. And that's in there. Base hit. And the funny thing about this at bat is that he does everything wrong on this swing. I mean, first off, this pitch is out of the strike zone. And secondly, he, he tries to pull it instead of taking it the other way. Anyhow, it pays off for him. The second baseman, Robinson Cano, will stand in. He comes off an 0 for 4 in last night's ball game. And a check swing here. Wow. That clearly breaks the plane as he set down for the first shot. Damn it. Well, let's take a look at this check swing here and show motion. From this speed, it almost oh. always looks like the guy goes around. Here? Now? Well, it looked like a good call down there at third base. I think that bat did break the plane, and that is a strike. Yeah, I did break the plane, though. Mike's Mike Zanino will get his first opportunity here. Took an 0 for 4 in the victory last night. Pitch on its way now to Zanino. Ah, uh, struck out. out. Lester's striking people but, out. And this is a scroll he's taken five times in this series now. That slow walk back to dugout after getting punched out. And after a while, these things, they start to wear on you. You've got to try to keep the mindset that Every at bat is a new opportunity, but most of the time, that's easier said than done. Logan Morrison gets a shot now with deuces all around. Two on, two out here in inning number two. Oh, two now from Lester. Swing, hard hit ball to second. 
And the two-out threat will not come to pass as the inning is over. The Mariners leave a couple. We'll go to the bottom of the second. No score. Kyle Schwarber will stride forward now, looking to keep that hit streak alive. Currently at six games entering play. Now the pitch. And he takes something off here as this is a lazy fly ball out to center field. Laughlin is there and he has it for the first down. There we go. Jason Laughlin is ready here as we begin the top of the fourth. Now the first pitch here from Lester. Ooh. Now a ball we go. toward right center. And that's into the gap and should Double. be extra bases. And a very quick start to the inning here. It's a first pitch double. So quickly in the scoring position here following the opposite field double. And we'll give you a look there at the Mariners leaderboard to this point in the season. And he currently finds himself right at the top of the list in that department. William Sasaki will stand in now with a good chance to break the seal here following the leadoff double. Well, it's a good RBI opportunity, but you've got to remember your first job, which is to at least get that guy over to third base. Now Lester's 0-1. And this is in the air to straightaway right. We'll see if it's enough to get that runner to third. Robinson Cano in now. He went down looking in his first trip to the plate. Cano waiting on the 0-1. There we go, Cano. Pulled softly toward the right side of the field. And that's oh, threw into right it. field for a base hit. And they're contested to play station to station here as the bases are loaded now with still nobody out. Well, if you're going to hook a curveball away, you've got to have strong hands. And you'll see, this swing breaks down a little bit. But look at him get those hands to Mike Zanino will dig in here with the bases loaded now. And their best opportunity yet to get on the board. They've had a few chances and come up empty, so they can't let this one get away from them. Bases loaded here, nobody out. All right, maybe it'll get us a grand slam, but it's highly unlikely. Now here we, we go. Sacrifice attempt here, and it should oh. do the job. Ah, attack, attack. For one. Tagged it home and play. got him out at first. Damn it. Three nothing Mariners. Jason Lofgren will dig in. Let's see if I can get a triple on a home run for a uh, cycle. The very first one by me. Now this ball should back up the middle, and he's got himself another base uh, hit, his third of the afternoon. Not bad, not bad. And so far, he's throwing a lot of fastballs here early in the count. And these guys have picked up on that, so they're just going up there looking for the hard stuff, and they've been all over him. William Sasaki digs in. He reached on a single and would later wind up scoring in his last at bat. Swing and a ball hit softly on the ground. Zobrist. Oh! Runs all they were ever going to get, and the inning will continue. 
Oh, this is a much Damn. easier play for a left-handed first baseman. To nice make, team we're especially wondering. Especially when you're charging in like that. He doesn't have to turn his back to the play, so he gets a good gauge on whether he still has time or not. Ooh. He's able to fire I was out, but wow. A hard out, I should say. Out. Kyle Schwarber will come forward now. He has flied out in singles so far. Jason Lofgren digs in, coming off a single in his last at bat. Now a ball lying toward the gap. Ah. Schwarber is there, and he'll make the catch to retire the side. Mariners leave one, but they lead it three nothing. I wonder if CM Punk is going to sing the Take Me Out to the Ball Game song. Mariners won! Woohoo! Well, you always hope to get a James Paxton. Wow, that's where he gets player of the game. Beyond in this one, he's our top player of the game. Yeah, he was really overpowering guys out there. Look at the line score. He winds up with 11 strikeouts, and he definitely was a deciding factor in this one. So that's a wrap here this afternoon. For EK, Psycho, and the rest of our crew, I'm Matt Vaskirchen. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, log on to theshownation.com. The Mariners win it 3-1. So long from Ridley Hill. Thank you.